Another Turkish army video. This one is called Bordo Berele e Timme Turkenin and Zor Askere e Timlere, which translates roughly to Turkey's hardest military training. The title speaks for itself, there's no point in me trying to explain that. By the way, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment on this video. Tell me what you think. But let's watch it now. Korko e Timme. I think that's fear training or something like that. I don't like where this is going with that title. Pop on mine. Wow, this that was a fighter jet as well. Do you know how loud these, how loud commercial planes are? And you saw how the camera just shook away. I need to see this again. Oh, the cameraman ducked at least. <laughs> He's happy. He didn't get scared. I would imagine just the vibration alone is too much. Yeah, in you go, mate. Tied up and thrown in the ocean. Or sea. Or lake. People find it hard to swim normally, never mind taped up. Now with a gun, but not tied up. Is it not amazing what humans can do when they need to? Like, you hear these stories about you know, women who lifted cars because their kid was under it and stuff like that, so. But these lot train for it. Synchronized military drill. I wonder what their punishment is if they get it wrong. If you know, let me know in the comments. Looks like a parade. Oh, okay, so now we're looking at sparring. By the way, yes, army uh, sparring like this is choreographed, obviously. They're not going to fight, you know, full, full on. Puts them in an armbar. But yes, they're not going to fight full on. It's uh, for the purpose of training. If you ever trained in fighting, you'd know what I'm saying. Whoa. Oh, he pulled the flag out of it as well. This can't be easy on the knees. Okay, I didn't get time to read that. Skipping rope is harder than it looks, I tell you now. Don't be fooled because schoolgirls do it, but... <laughs> it's a different level of intensity, this. Wow, bench pressing, one arm press up. I mentioned it during the watching that clip as well, that it's amazing what humans can do when they put their mind to it. And again with this through training and everything they do in preparation for in case there is a war, if they're called upon uh, as soldiers. I mean, these aren't base level soldiers anyway. And now these uh, commandos are training for uh, a potential war just to defend the country. This is a training they have to endure. Now imagine them in the scenario like that example I gave of the mother who lifted the car. She wasn't, a, you know, training or gym or anything, but it was just something that came over her where she had to lift the car to save her child. Now imagine what these lot could do in a similar situation. So, and yeah, I do a bit of training myself, but it's uh, nowhere on these these kind of levels. And if you're on these kind of levels, you're probably in that, uh, well, not probably, you are in that top 1% of uh, healthy or the fittest people in the world. So let me know what you think. Put it in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, drop a like on the video, and I'll catch you on the next video, inshallah.